How's it going everyone? And we're just out here cleaning up some old frames, comb, and things. We took the foundation out of here, or not the foundation, but the comb off of here. These little strings, this is 30 pound test line, it's a little bit loose. And what we do is we come over here and we'll grab this, string this right here this line and we'll pull it tight again and then all we do is just staple it there bam and they're back to tight this frame right here it was just an old black comb so we uh, took it out and threw it away we have a five gallon bucket right here so old comb will melt down but in when you're putting the new foundation in if you get yourself a box blade with this little hook thing on it it's for like roofing and stuff to cut shingles then you can scrape through this little line right here clear out the beeswax and then again right here on this on this one right here and you just clear that out and then that way this this foundation will go right back in and then once we get doing that then we're gonna wax it so we got our this is just a roasting pan full of good wax and then there's our frame we scraped this one off it was easy to do we take a foam roller like so and you just want to wax it just like that you don't need just a whole ton of it get it over there in the corners flip it over and do this side it's real simple just like that and then you have a wax frame so that you can put in your colony this right here this one you can see they have a little bit of drawn out so we took it out let them finish it up but over here in the corners right here we put a little bit more wax on it this one's a little bit thick wax it's all right it's not going to do anything and has a little bit of comb already drawn this green frame right here in case nobody's seen one that's called a drone frame so this is drone uh, foundation they will draw drone cells off of it we give a lot of our colonies one frame of those to keep it going over here we're going through old comb and seeing what we want to replace and what we don't so this right here has a little bit of pollen in here we'll watch it but here's some wax moth damage and stuff a frame like this the bees will easily use up it's still got good life in it um, but again they'll, they'll repair all this they'll get it out of that hive that's not a big deal one like this a little mouse got into it while it was in storage chewed up some comb right there that's not a big deal the bees will repair it and they'll probably shrink it down but they probably won't close it and it'll just be like a little hole like this so they can go in and out um, on these foundationless frames they do a lot of that especially around here that way they don't have to walk all the way up and over here's one that's a drone comb that they built and they'll get it finished up this year and again it has a little bit of some wax moth but there was nothing in it so the wax moth couldn't do anything so they just got a little bit of webby not a big deal though and uh here's another one right here on this one right here so there's a little bit more damage and stuff and I'd like it to be a nice comb so what I'll do is I'll just cut it here right above or right below this first green wire and it will remove this and then that will act like a starter strip up here and then they'll redraw it but there's no no point in getting all the way a frame like this so that's a queen queen cup that's in it but a frame like this it's, it's, it's dark um, it has foundation in it. What we'll do is we'll pop this foundation off and we will get rid of it mainly because 
right here all this is old pollen and it is basically this whole frame of this side and we or the bees will not reuse this so this is basically a dead frame so this this side even though it has pollen in it they won't reuse this pollen because it's old so we always get rid of that and like i said with the foundation you just pop them out take that knife scrape the little things out and insert your foundation wax it up and it's good to go so that's just what we're doing we're going to check our board um boxes we'll get a video up of that while we're doing it get the second boxes going on the hives this week though um, for the next 10 days or so hopefully the whole entire operation is filled with double boxes um, season's getting ready to kick off it's fun time alrighty we'll catch you guys on the next one see ya